That is it for yes. our list. Okay. Okay, moving forward. Here yes. we go. Ah, ah, she is the nanny with magical powers who flies with an umbrella. This is going to be fun. Mary Poppins started out as a series of books. It was made into a classic movie in 1964. Of course, it starred Julie Andrews and Dick Van Dyke, and now it's been on stage since 2004. The musical is touring the country, and today we are joined by two stars of the show, Caroline Sheen, who plays Mary, and Gavin Lee, who plays Chimney Sweep Bert, one of Mary's dear friends. Let's take a look. Chim, chim, on each, chim, chim, on each, chim, chim, to be A sweep is as lucky as lucky can be Chim, chim, on each, chim, chim, on each, chim, chim, to rue Good luck will rub off when he shakes hands with you Or blow me a kiss, Bert And that's lucky too Welcome to daytime, you two. Good to have you here. Thank, Thank you. Thank you. Sounding good. Great <laughs> voices. <laughs> yes, no kidding. And tough shoes to fill when you consider Julie Andrews and Dick Van Dyke. I mean, my gosh. Yeah. Who could off. possibly ever fill them, really? Well, apparently we try our best. We try our best. But okay. we're very lucky with this show that we're not just... Uh, the creators didn't decide to just pick up the movie and plop it on the stage. So it's uh, they went back to the original P.L. Travers books and took out characters and storylines from there, as well as obviously taking all the best songs and the best scenes from the movie. Yeah. And they've come up with this new Mary Poppins for the stage. And uh, amazing that it's the first time it's ever been on, put on stage since 1964 it when the movie came out. Amazing. It took that long. <laughs> Didn't it hit Broadway in 2006? 2006, yep, still yeah. running on Broadway. It's in its fourth year, yep. That's I did a couple of years there, and then did I you? came out on the tour, yeah. Oh, wow. So He's how done it all. <laughs> how is this different from the movie? There are um, slightly different kind of um, atmospheres in it, so it's slightly darker. Oh. Um, Mary takes them to some more serious places. I mean, it's still great fun and very colorful and very exciting, but there's a real kind of contemporary edge to it. You know, that Mr. Banks is a banker like he is in the film, but also there's the banking issues and very kind of he's about similar to, lose his to job. what yeah, he's going to lose his couldn't job. Be more like the know, reflection the of the yes, time. Exactly. Yes. So it, it's, it's just kind of an updated feel. It's obviously still set in the same era, but it's just an updated feel. And the kids start off slightly more unruly than they do in the movie. <laughs> They're so naughty. They're brats they really at the are. beginning of the movie, uh, at the beginning of the stage yeah. show. Two yeah. kids? Two kids. Two kids in the show, but we have four, four kids. So we have two Michaels and two Janes, and they alternate, so they do four shows a week. God. Whereas, obviously, the adults do eight shows a week. Oh, I, I don't know if people understand how difficult uh, doing as many shows a week and traveling from city to city and moving you know the sets and the props and everything else that has to go along with it um do you uh, uh gavin do you get like dirty and do the the oh yeah chimney the, sweep yeah, thing yeah, and the whole bit? i mean i mean the amount of not only costume and wig changes that the whole everyone has in the show but the makeup changes as well you might not even notice but every single scene that the ensemble do they're in different makeup as well and they're yeah. full-on statue makeup and toy makeup and when uh, anyone first starts the show, they, their skin kind of goes out and, you know, like, <laughs> blotches Red and spotty oh, and, you yeah. know, then you get used to it. And, but, um, and it, even, even as much as I have, like, three lipstick changes. I mean, you, <laughs> I don't even know if you even register that, but from one time I'm in a pink outfit, so I have pink lipstick, then I'm in a red, and then I have red lipstick, so it's Meticulous. really detailed. Yeah, really yeah and you're going real time, so it's not like you've got, you know, a chance to take a break. No, nope. <laughs> you know, I always say the choreography is amazing in the show, but if you had a chance to be in the wings and see the choreography in the wings, just I would love getting to out, see that. out, out of the way of chimneys yeah. rushing, you know, chimney stacks are rushing on and yeah. off, and people are doing quick changes in and out of Jolly Holiday, where it goes colorful and then back to black and white, yeah. and uh, it's crazy backstage as well as hopefully exciting and energetic on stage. We're watching footage now. Do you ever go blank and go, oh gosh, I have no <laughs> idea what I'm, I'm, do you improvise a lot? Uh, there's not a huge amount of people say that, that sometimes I did go blank the other day and I was like, oh my god. But luckily it's a, it's a moment where I could pause and I just held that pause a little longer and ended up still getting laughs. So I was quite oh pleased good. with myself. Do you ever crack yourselves up when, when you're on stage? I mean, after you've done something so many times, well, like, that's the sometimes thing. we I get mean, into laughing. Yeah, I, mm. I would assume there's got to be some moments when you just kind of like, quite we're, we're quite good. good. We're quite good because you kind of feel that responsibility of you're the lead of the show. Right. And the audience, yeah. You sure. can't be seen that you're just messing around but uh, I've been doing the show so long that if I concentrate too much on the lines or the choreography I will actually forget them <laughs> so it's uh. my job is to kind of be a bit on autopilot right but still make it look like it's the first time I've ever done it otherwise yeah. if I really think about a line I'm like 
And now I don't know what that line is. <laughs> and when you first put the harness on and, and took off with yeah. your umbrella, yeah. mm -hmm. was that terrifying or really exciting? The first time I did it, because I'd never done it before, I was like, what am I letting myself in for? But the f uh, now it's just so easy. It's the easiest part of the show for me. I, when my feet are on the floor, I'm running, I'm tap dancing, right. I'm doing magic, I'm singing. Um, but when <laughs> I'm up airborne, I'm... I'm just there, and everyone else is doing all the hard work. And she goes right off um, over the whole audience every show. Right. Whatever right. city we're in around yeah. America, they yeah. they rig it so that you can fly somewhere. Yeah. And she it's flies amazing. right over the orchestra and now out into who knows where. Uh -huh. Both of you are clearly talented and have <laughs> great <laughs> resumes about that long of all the things that we've, you've done. We've been very lucky, I think. Been around, uh, Caroline, <laughs> Caroline, you have a, a CD out called Raise the Curtain. I do. And it's just kind of a, a, a mixture of some wonderful show tunes and, and yeah. various things. My, and my aim with it was to showcase the future of musical theatre. So there are some musical theatre composers and writers on there who I think are going to take us into the next kind of decade, 20, 50 years of mm. having some wonderful musical theatre in front mm. of us. Wonderful. So. Looking well, forward to hearing the rest of this. I heard a couple of cuts and they are marvelous. Oh, great. Thank you. Continued <laughs> success with the show. Thank, Thank you, you very you. much. Yes. Thank you for having stay me. Stay healthy the story. and stay careful. And well, stay touring yeah. the country. I, I, I mean, stay married. Yeah, we'll say Caroline. it separately, but Not we'll yet, stay married well, as well. Right. 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 But we feel very lucky being British and being in America touring this fantastic country and seeing so many cities. and. We're just having a great time, so anyone come along and see how what a great time we're having. Yeah, <laughs> well, we are happy to have you here. Yes. You can see Mary Poppins at the David A. Strath Jr. Center uh, for the Performing Arts in Tampa. We highly recommend it. Go to daytimeonline.tv for more information. And coming up on daytime, uh, well, we've got...